Okay, so the other day I got this in the mail. I've waited to open this. Um, originally I was going to do a, a full-on video on all this, but I decided just to do a quick little something-something, I guess. This is the first time I've opened this. I did pull the, the plastic off of the um, the box itself, but this is basically what it comes in a painting guide. All kinds of interesting little tidbits. I think this is the same one that comes in most um, most of the sets that this is like the second or third well, actually like all of my all my paints I have two sets up here this is all two sets of the same thing um, so I have two color like this is oak brown oak brown uh, monster brown monster brown and so on and so forth so I actually have two sets on display here of the same thing um, and I think I got that when I got that set but uh, the speed paint is what I've I'm very interested in and have been looking forward to. Now, I got this from War Game Delivered, I believe is the name of it. Um, according to their email that they sent me uh, pertaining to this purchase, they said, okay, you know, this is a pre-order. It's going to ship March 26th, I believe, if I remember. End of March. I received it on the 14th. So I was like, dude, what the, okay, cool. Now the other half of my order though, still hasn't shown up, which is the Army Painter Speed, not Speed Paint, but Army Painter Airbrush Mega Set. Uh, this is $98 on their site. The Airbrush, was 180 and I still haven't received it so I'm a little bit uh, worried about that I think it was the 15th of last month February it's currently the 16th of March so I haven't heard anything at all about anything from them, so I'm a little concerned about what's going on with that anyway um, comes with a brush which it's a fairly big tip on a brush it's probably a lot bigger than what i prefer i've got several brushes over here um lots and lots i've got my artist opus my really good brushes are over there um my dry brush brushes are under there which i've got one of them because i've been working on this guy um and then i've got some like a bunch of amazon just mediocre brushes and then I've got trash brushes all along here so anyway that's a decent brush I'll, well the thing just flew off it's hard doing this with one hand anyway uh, I'll add that to the the witchman jig I'll end up using it. I mean, a, a good big brush is always nice to have when you're trying to, like on something like this, trying to do that wing that would come in handy. Um, he's coming along pretty good. I've gotten the base. It's pretty much done. I'm working on him, obviously, which I'm making some pretty good progress. Can't really see because my other light isn't on, but he's, he's slowly coming. I'm actually not going to do too much on him because he's supposed to be a black dragon. So just by priming him black, um, you're pretty 90% done. Just got to do a little bit of the detail. Um, and then I've got him that this is, honestly, this is going to come into big play on him. So anyway, um, yep, comes preloaded. 
with two, two of these, which I keep a, plenty of these for all of the, a lot of my paints up here all have bearings in them, I think. Yep, that one's got it. Yep, that one's got it. Yep, it's in there. So sometimes I haven't used a color or just haven't gotten around to put one in there. Um, so I'm very excited about this. I can't wait to get into these and start using these. Um, for somebody like me, man, come on, let it go. Serious? Man, that was childproof. Almost childproof. They attempted to childproof it. So there's the medium. Interesting. Some of these colors look pretty good. That, that's a really good looking blue right there. Interesting. I also find it interesting that the um, uh, the square on the so like okay the regular paint just has the color, whereas this has all three colors that possibly come because speed paints give you a little bit more depth. For those who aren't aware of what what speed paints all about. So that's kind of cool that it shows you the possible colors that you're going to end up getting. And that's on every single one of these. Good looking red. So like blood red. Um, cursed. Dragon red maybe. I mean, that looks pretty close on the label but then you look at the color itself it looks like black it's kind of weird that's a very deep red even mixing up in the light you can see a little bit of some of the red in there but that looks really really dark that's impressed that's pretty crazy these blues look really, really good. So, anyway. So, the next thing I, one of the projects that I, I of the thousands of projects that I have to do, uh, number one, I gotta finish that. I gotta finish that, finish that, finish that, finish that. Finish, yeah, I, I never really actually finish a lot of my projects i just get them all in the progress and then move on to something else but this box has all of this for over there for this paint and the airbrush paint that i have coming so i think i need to get off my butt and start getting all of that out of there See, the problem that I'm, one of the reasons why I'm holding off on that is because if you look down there, those are all the pieces and that's the, what it comes like from Hobby Zone. Well, I painted all mine, which me, as you can tell, my paint job was quick and fast because I was not taking my time. Um, plus, I, I didn't prime these on some of these because I ran out of primer. So, because I'm going to paint the same stuff, I have to pull all that out, prime it all, paint it, and go through the whole diatribe of stuff that goes involved with that. Which, um, it hasn't been warm enough out. It's been in the 30s. So, painting is, I can't paint in the house on that scale because... Uh, my wife has severe asthma, and the, the can fumes will literally make her die. So, I don't do that. Um, 
so I got to wait until it gets warm. And it's, I think it's 60 today. I could be out doing it, but I'm being lazy and making a video and then I'm going to go play Destiny. Yep. Life choices. Anyway. All right. I'm just yammering and really not talking about anything else right now. So I'll look forward to uh, come back and you can see I'll be using this on that one down there. Him quite a bit. So we'll see how it turns out. Hopefully he'll he'll look pretty good. I may use uh, some around the mouth and face. I may use some of the speed paint, um, like in the tongue and the uh, <clears throat> the teeth and whatnot. Probably use it there. I still got to do the the horns. Um, I'm thinking he's looking pretty good. I, I'm liking the, the variations in the green on the chest so far. Um, but he's, he's turning out pretty good. I'm digging it. So I still got a lot of work on him left to do. Anyway, all right. Thanks for watching. Y'all have a great day. Take care.